November 1966, three years before the Apollo astronauts made it to the moon. The Orbiter 2 spacecraft situates itself in lunar orbit. It was designed to capture high-resolution images of the surface. One image in particular catches the eye of researchers as it shows what appears of several pointed spires. From obelisks, and what's so bizarre is that this area has undeniable architecture that looks like what you would see from obelisks. There's eight different spires, and scientists calculated that the largest of these spires would be an obelisk that is 15 stories tall. These do appear to be just like an Egyptian-style obelisk, but what the heck are they doing on the moon? Obelisk. The obelisk is an architectural feature that originated in the Old Kingdom of Egypt around 2300 BC. The Egyptians would embellish all four sides of the obelisk shaft with hieroglyphs that included religious dedications, most commonly for the sun god Ra. The obelisk here symbolically represents Geb, the male god Earth, who sexually contacts with Nut, the female goddess, the sky. Phallic architecture consciously or unconsciously creates a symbolic representation of the human penis. Buildings intentionally or unintentionally or unintentionally resembling the human penis are a source of amusement to locals and tourists in various places around the world. Deliberate phallic imagery is found in ancient cultures and in the links to ancient cultures found in traditional artifacts. The ancient Greeks and Romans celebrated phallic festivals and built a shrine with an erect phallus to honor Hermes, messenger of the gods. The festival starts with this big penis reveal ceremony followed by a super fun parade where locals dance and shake this big holy penis that has superpowers. Figures may be related to the ancient Egyptian deity. When you go down the Champs Elysees, you will come face to face with an Egyptian obelisk. Like many Parisians, you may have wondered how that obelisk has arrived at Place de la Concorde, literally in the middle of Paris. Nearly 75 feet in height and 250 tons. This imposing column of pink granite has more than 3,000 years of history. And let me tell you one thing. Its journey to stand here has been a true epic. This Egyptian monument of solid red granite was brought to Rome about 2,000 years ago and was already considered extremely ancient at that time. Old Kingdom Pyramid text says, the House of Ra. Ever noticed this obelisk on Wisconsin Avenue? I'm Joe Himmely, and today I'm in Georgetown in Washington, D.C. It stands next to the CNO Canal, this 1850 granite obelisk.
the history that we were all taught growing up is wrong. And I'm a forensic geologist. There's a hidden history in this country that nobody knows about. There are pyramids here, chambers, tombs, inscriptions. They're all over this country. We're gonna investigate these artifacts and sites and we're gonna get to the truth. Sometimes history isn't what we've been told.